Lesson 2, Using Report Designer, Developing Basic Reports. Part 1, Creating a View Open SQL Server Management Studio and create vcars view Part 2, Creating a New Report Project Open SQL Server Business Intelligence Development Studio, or SQL Server Data Tools. On the File menu, point to New, and then click Project. In the New Project dialog box, click the Report Server Project template in the Business Intelligence Projects folder. Type in a name for the project and then click OK. Part 3, Creating a new report. In Solution Explorer, right click the reports folder, point to add, and then click new item. In the Add New Item dialog box, click the Report Template. Type a report name, report to RDL and then click Add. Part 4, Connecting to a Data Source. In Solution Explorer, right click the Shared Data Sources folder, and then click Add New Data Source. Change the name of this data source from Data Source 1 to DSV Cars. Click Edit. In the Connection Properties dialog box, type the server name. Click Use Windows Authentication. In the Select or Enter a Database Name drop-down list, select Car Transactions. Click OK twice. Part 5, Adding Items from the Toolbox and Working with Data Sets. In the Toolbox window, click Table. Click Use Shared Data Source References, select DSV Cars and click Next. Type the SQL statement to define a query string for the data set. Click Run on the Dataset toolbar to test the query and see the result set. Click Finish. Click First Field and select Car. Then click Second Field and click Model. Click Third Field and select Category. 
Right click the table, click insert column and then click right. Click fourth field and select company. Part 6, Coloring Table Headers Click Preview tab Right click column name and click text box properties Set the font properties. Then set fill color and click OK. Perform the same steps for the other headers. Click Preview tab. Part 7, Sorting Table Rows. Right click the text box in the first column of the table header and then click text box properties. Click the interactive sort tab. Select the enable interactive sort action to this text box. Select cars in the sort by drop down list. Then click OK. Click preview tab. Click the double arrows icon next to the car column label. Click the sort icon again to change the sort order to descending. Part 8. Grouping data in a table. Right click the row handle for the detail row, and then click add group. Then click parent group. Select category from group by list. Then select add group footer and click OK. Delete group 1 text box. Click Preview tab. Click Design tab. Select Footer fields. Change the fill color. Click Preview tab.
Part 9, Computing Group Subtotals, Creating Calculated Fields. Right click foot a field and click expression. Click common functions and then click aggregate to view its members. Double click count distinct to add it to the expression pane. Click fields, data detail, to view its members. Double click car field, and then type right parenthesis. Click OK. Click Preview tab. Thank you for watching this lesson. Watch the other lessons. Open a browser and type www.learn-with-video-tutorials.com. Do you want to learn new skills in the fastest and most effective way? Visit learnwithvideotutorials.com